let's start block one. Let's jump in. Rates and equilibria. So I think what's really, really important is to understand that rates and equilibria is essentially, all it is is about um, how do we reach an equilibrium? How do we reach like a homeostasis? So in the body, an equilibrium is what we refer to as homeostasis. Um, so you might know it as sort of body temperature. Our body loves to sit at a very comfortable 37.5 something. Um, that is homeostasis. Our body likes that equilibrium. When we run, we get hot, we sweat. That sweat allows sort of air to cool our skin down and cool us down, things like that. Um, when we get really cold, we shiver and the shivering makes the muscles move and the muscles end up heating up the inside of the body. So same sort of thing. We'd love to stay at that constant, you know, 37 degrees. And that equilibrium is all coming from um, sort of homeostasis. So in chemistry, we refer to that as equilibriums. We're also gonna talk about rates as well as a part of that. So I like to break the topic up. And these are the two things I like to break it into. So I like to break it into um, reaction rates and I like to break it into equilibrium or equilibria. So I think I spelled equilibrium wrong there, but nonetheless, we have reaction rates, which is essentially how quick something occurs and why does it occur? So why is a reaction occurring? Why is it occurring at this pace? So think about why does it occur? Why does it occur at this rate? Um, that is all we talk about with reaction rates. And then how do we manipulate that? Then equilibriums is a little bit different. Equilibriums is where we talk about irreversible versus reversible. Um, we talk about sort of dynamic equilibriums, like why does equilibrium, why do the reactions keep occurring but nothing looks like it's happening? Um, quantifying and then calculation. So reaction rates is very um, qualitative information. So it's very like, you know, discussing words, writing down, equilibriums. There's a little bit of qualitative, but it's mainly quantitative. You're mainly gonna be looking at numbers, manipulation, calculations. For those who are more maths based, you're gonna enjoy that so much more. So 